There are countless stories of heroism that can be shared about America's veterans on this day we honor them. John Meyer profiles one from Luzerne County, a man who served his nation in World War II, then served his neighbors as a hero during the notorious Knox Mine disaster. Bill Hasty died this week at the age of 101. He is the focus of this week's On the Pennsylvania Road. It may be the most dramatic film footage in northeastern Pennsylvania history. The Susquehanna River turned into a whirlpool after the water broke through the Knox Mine below. And Bill Hasty saw this in person. On the day of the disaster, Hasty was there that day in 1959 and part of a recent Knox Mine disaster documentary. I have not led a sheltered life, but I was a little shaken up at what I saw. What he saw was a mine flooding with water here near Pittston, with men still inside. There was a, an enormous crashing sound, and then a Niagara Falls. The rock men were trapped. They were down below. We began pulling, pulling men out. We talked with Bill Hasty on his 100th birthday last year. He wore his World War II veteran's hat. This is a man who served his country in Europe. He served his community as West Pittston Borough Council President and still had vivid memories of helping to rescue dozens of miners at Knox. We had difficulties galore, but we overcame them except, well, we lost men. 12 were lost that day, but it could have been more if it weren't for the efforts of Hasty and others. Yet over the years when Mike Stevens and others talked to Bill, it wasn't about him. It was about what happened. It wasn't a case of robbing pillars at that particular instance, but it was a case of taking coal, removing coal that shouldn't have been removed. Bill Hasty died this week at 101, just days before Veterans Day. As we mark this day, his is just one story of American heroism at war and at home. In this COVID world, we are honoring our vets a bit differently this year, but a virus can't stop our feeling of gratitude, our desire to pay tribute. Bill Hasty is an example of many veterans, not looking for praise, but deserving it. We say goodbye to him and thank you to all. John Meyer, Newswatch 16 on the Pennsylvania Road in Luzerne County.